My name is Lenny Samuel. My friends call me Len. I'm a detective. I work in Los Angeles. I'm an L.A. detective. Everybody in Los Angeles is busy, but Len isn't busy. He's sitting in his office, waiting. He has no work today. Nothing is happening. Then a man comes into the office. Len doesn't know him. The man is short and dark. He's about 40 years old and is wearing a suit. The man is holding a gun. The gun is pointing at Len. I'm Frank. Come with me. Mr. Blaine wants to speak to you. I won't go with you, Frank. I don't like Mr. Blaine. I don't want to speak to him. Frank is a tough man. He laughs and hits Len on the head. He hits Len hard. Len's eyes close, and he falls onto the floor of the office. Len wakes up. He opens his eyes. He's sitting in a big chair. The room is very warm, and there are lots of plants in the room. Where am I? Hello, Mr. Samuel. Welcome to my house. An old man is talking and smiling. He's Mr. Blaine. He's a very rich man and also a very bad man. You're going to help me, Mr. Samuel. You're going to find my daughter. Read these letters. Carmen is our prisoner. We want $100,000. Give us the money, then Carmen will come home. Meet us on Tuesday at 2 p.m. at the bus station. The young one's father, help, please, give them the money. Carmen is 18, she has long, dark hair, and her eyes are blue. She's beautiful. Mr. Blaine gives Len a photo. He says, I want Carmen back. Go to the bus station at 2 o'clock on Tuesday. Frank has the $100,000, he's going with you. Give the money to the young ones, bring Carmen home. I'll pay you $1,000. Len says, I don't like you, Blaine, I don't want your money. But Carmen is in trouble, she needs help. I'll help her. It's 2 p.m. on Tuesday. Frank and Len are at the bus station. Frank has $100,000 in a bag. Large buses are going in and out of the bus station. There are lots of people, but Len can't see Carmen. Frank and Len wait. Then they see Carmen. She's standing by a bus, and a young man is with her. The young man is holding Carmen's arm. Hello. Are you Carmen Blaine? I'm working for your father. Who are you? I'm from the Young Ones. Where's the money? Here it is. Frank opens the bag. The young man sees the money and lets go of Carmen's arm. Len holds Carmen's arm. Frank gives the bag of money to the young man. Suddenly, Carmen bites Len's hand. Len lets go of Carmen's arm. Oh! The young man hits Frank. Frank falls down. Carmen and the young man jump onto the bus. The door of the bus closes, and it drives off. It's going to San Francisco. Len can't get on the bus. He decides to get his car and drive to San Francisco. Len is in his car, he's driving to San Francisco. He's going to find Carmen. Why is Carmen going to San Francisco? Who is the young man? It's Thursday. Len is in San Francisco. San Francisco is a big city, Len can't find Carmen. Suddenly, Len sees a sign on a building. The sign says the young ones, the building is a school for poor children. Carmen is playing with the children. 
Len stops his car and goes to speak to Carmen. I don't want to go home. I'm happy here. I like working at this school. The $100,000 is for the school. My father is a bad man. These papers show he is a criminal. Take the papers to the police. You stay here. Nobody will find you. I'll take the papers to the police. Good luck. It's Friday. Len is in Los Angeles. He's at the police station. Frank and Blaine are at the police station too. These papers show that you're a criminal, Blaine. Huh, I'm tired. I have no money, but I have an exciting job, and I like to help people. That's why I'm an L.A. detective. 